Good morning, YouTube. And everybody out there, all the happy campers. <clears throat> this is take two, or the completion of the first video. Um, a few days ago, we had the mulcher in here. Get rid of uh, some trees. Made me some driveways and some clearings for each lot. So we're just going to take a view here of everything and uh, show you what was done. So right here is the tail end of my one acre that I'm not using. So I had a little spot carved out. And this is the little spot for, I'm hoping, a little lady who's got a pop-up camper that wants to come in here. That's Highway 11. <coughs> so, the adjacent acre is this one here. And in the back half of it, or the back end of it, back here, we have a clearing, Here we got a clearing made in here. <coughs> That's one clearing for the second clearing. Back this way, this is spot number three. It's got a nice little clearing on it. I'm sure you're getting my walking exercise this morning. I don't remember the end one up here where he made the spot. <coughs> it's still a little rugged until people are driving in and out of here for a while before it packs down. So it's a little spongy. A little soft with all the mulch sitting on top, but it should pack down. <coughs> So here's another spot over here. We have another clearing made here. <coughs> and then we're coming up to another driveway. Honestly, don't remember this spot on the left. What, 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 what the spot looks like anymore? Oh, that was the really nice spot, I think. These two spots are the biggest spots, the ones at the back here, and they also butt up to Crown Land. So whoever rents these spots, they can make themselves a trail and. And it'll clear into the crown land. <coughs> oh yeah. Okay. So 
here we got this spot and for some reason I don't remember the clearing he made on here this is really hard on my back walking through all this stuff these roads are a lot better the back roads spot is way back here out of the way <coughs> so there's a bit of a clearing here Slope a little bit there, but you can always put something under your dog legs for your trailer or whatever you're building. And the last spot, this spot, and the other spot, I think are the best two spots. <coughs> Only because they're a bit bigger than an acre. And it butts up on Crown Land. So, the back end being Crown Land means you get to explore there all you want, use the land all you want, nobody's going to bother you. So, your land is like friggin' 10,000 acres. I don't know exactly how big the crown land is back here, but it's huge. <coughs> and here's the last spot. they can use the driveway as part of their spot so it works out well <coughs> make a clearing going through there and you can get onto the crown land so I should have made each clearing after it was done I should have made each clearing one on one end and the other one on the back end but I wasn't thinking so these two spots worked out really well. <coughs> I guess it worked out the same one here at this end. <coughs> oh, I know why we didn't, because the land drops down back there a bit. So, as far as this road goes, this is one spot. This is the second spot, as far as that road goes. And the same this way, as far as that road goes. So these are uh, 235 feet by 175 on these lots. These four lots are 175 by 235. And I'm not quite sure how wide this spot is. I didn't measure. But I think it's a little bit bigger than... 175. I think it's closer to 200. <coughs> so, this is Tiny Town. Waiting for people to come and fill it up with giggles and laughs and 
cheers of joy, sounds of happy campers. <clears throat> this is what I'm hoping for. Build what you want, do what you want on the spot. You want to make it bigger, cut more trees down yourself. I think I've done a fair enough job on getting it ready for people to move in. Um, raw forest, and it's what it is. Lots of firewood left in here. If somebody wants firewood, that's a really nice big fat pine there. Well, I think that's a pine. I don't know. It goes up quite a ways. It's got quite a trunk on it. Some of these are really big. Uh, well, not that big, but you know how it is. For a city boy, any tree is big. <laughs> it's a far cry from Hamilton. Can't do this in any city. You have to have unorganized township land to do this or follow city bylaws and pay all their fees pay for all their inspections this land you do what you want and there's a trucker having a fucking shower beside his truck <laughs> maybe I'll build an outdoor shower and charge these guys <coughs> So, this is the end of this video. Tiny Town is open for business. See you all soon. <laughs>